Now we're starting to see that snow uh, start to stick. So time to check in with meteorologist Lisa Hildago. Lisa, is this just a flurry or an all day event type thing? Yeah, no, you're right. It's an all day event. It's not going to be just in the morning. We're going to continue to see snow throughout the afternoon. So take a look at the emoji cast. Uh, temperatures dropping dramatically this morning, about seven to 10 degrees within just about an hour. So we're in the low 30s now. We'll see low 30s through the afternoon. So not much of a warm up, low to mid 30s and snow continuing to fall. Uh, right now we're expecting snow all day long. That's going to bring with it likely uh, some pretty good accumulation. It's going to clear out after midnight, but we could see about three to six inches of snow across the metro area by tonight, heavier in other spots. So on satellite and radar right now, you're going to find still a bit of a mix. Uh, the roads mainly just wet of De west wet north of Denver, but here in town as you get west and south, you are going to find more snow and that's going to turn over to all snow here pretty soon. Mid to upper 30s right now, Longmont close to 40, so it's a little bit warmer up to the north. Quite a bit colder down south near Highlands Ranch and Castle Rock where we're hovering near freezing right now. Now future cast is going to show that chance for snow throughout the day. It's going to be a light mix up across the northeastern plains. The totals up near Fort Collins and Greeley will likely be at around one to two inches, so that's going to be lighter to the north heavier to the south. This again continues through about six o'clock into tonight with winds out of the north at about 15 to 20 miles per hour. It's going to make these 30s feel more like 20s. So the kids are going to need a hat, jacket, gloves before you send them off to school this morning. Early tomorrow morning, we'll likely see temperatures in the 20s and you'll see again a partly cloudy sky. Snow will then at that point stop and we should see a partly cloudy sky tomorrow afternoon. Here's a look at some of the totals. Now the counties that are in purple, those are under a winter weather advisory. So no advisories north of Denver from E470 up to Fort Collins. We are advisory free, but we could get around one to two inches there. Here across the Denver metro area, winter weather advisory for about three to six inches. The Palmer Divide is going to be one of those spots where we get some heavier snow there in pink under a winter storm warning. And this right here, that one area, when you stretch from Douglas County up into Jefferson County, those southern foothills is where we could see over a foot of snow by tonight. Northern foothills, you're going to find less parts of Boulder County, likely at around about three to six. So any way you look at it, at least it's something. We have been so far below normal this season, so it's nice to finally get some snow. Uh, we really, really need it. Low to mid 30s today, upper 30s on Saturday. It's going to be pretty chilly Saturday, but we should see some 40s and some sunshine by Sunday. It looks really pretty for the second half of the weekend. Next week, Jace, well, from 60s yesterday to snow today to 50s by Monday. <laughs>